F could be do your homework before playtime. Yes. G, definitely no cursing. Oh, damn it. Why? It just seems like a good rule. I mean, I used to curse when I was younger, but... Yeah, but we won't we'll just curse. Cool. Yeah, we'll just okay. use that one. Um, H could be... No junk. No, no jump. loud noises. I know, I used to jump on a couch and make loud noise. But, but we just got a new couch, you know what? we'll just use that one. Yes. Playtime's over, it's almost seven. Time to clean up. Universes are ways of thinking about the world that order and legitimate it. After a period of time of living in a symbolic universe, you do not realize that you are thinking in terms of that symbolic universe anymore and it becomes your reality. So when you reach that red octagon that's on a metal pole, what do you do? 
I stopped. Why? Because I'm supposed to. Because it's a law. Who told you it was a law? My driver's ed teacher. <laughs> and who told him? I don't know. How do you know that this ground right now is UT? It's actually, this ground is not actually UT. What is it? It's Plant Hall. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and how do you know that's Plant Hall? Because there's signs that say Plant Hall. Oh, okay, because of the signs. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. So what and if they just put that sign in, but you said you've been here for eight years, so what if they put it in the day before you got here? Well, it's still a Plant so Hall museum. Home. So what if we and change the sign now? And actually a hotel. Okay, what if we change the sign now? It's then it's no longer Plant? Okay. It'll be the name of whatever whoever spends the money on. Okay, cool. That's why you're so changed. Just like every just like every dorm up in here, <laughs> they spend money to have their names on there. So we so yeah. coming here because we work here. Okay. Providing yeah. information for the University of Tampa. Yeah. Okay. How do you know that you work here? How do I know that I work here? Um, I got hired and I went through the interview process and Jen actually told me I work. Oh, so they said it. Okay. Yeah. He who has the bigger stick imposes his definition of reality. So I am a corporation. I have a mom and pop store. I have the bigger stick. So I impose my definition of reality. <laughs>